on the Zay May 12, 1902, poet Clementina Suarez is born. Clementina Suarez, a Honduran poet and writer, is recognized for being the first woman to publish a book of poetry in the history of Honduras. Birth, May 12, 1902. Death, 1981. Biography. Clementina was born in Juticalpa, Honduras, but from a very young age she decided to leave home and abandon her family since they wanted her to dedicate herself to so lightly to marriage. She took refuge in Tegucigalpa, where she liked to enjoy bohemian life like cafes and the company of men. She always considered herself as misunderstood by society a fact that encouraged her to take refuge in letters and from an early age she declared herself a feminist. On the other hand, her time was characterized by Victorian morality with which Clementina could never identify as she always had a free and rebellious spirit. She liked to wear shorts and was not shy about wearing swimsuits as she liked to celebrate her body and life through poetry. Clementina Suarez's career. Clementina Suarez firmly believed in the freedom of women and that they should not be submissive to the male sex. She was the only woman who spoke with great intellectuals such as Alejandro Castro, Alfonso Guillén Zelaya, Antonio Rosa, Guillermo Bustillo, among others, who were amazed at her great intellect. On the other hand, she traveled to great countries of the world, such as Mexico and New York, where she worked on her poetry and sought her freedom. In 1933, she founded the Revista Mujer, which she herself sold in the streets of Tegucigalpa. Among her most notable books are Bleeding Heart, Initials, The Last of My Saturdays, Fire Temples, Growing with the Grass, I Sing to the Found Homeland and Its Hero, The Poet and His Signs, with my verses, I greet future generations. This was a day in the history of Honduras.